And now to the latest in the wildfires that are burning in California right now. Fire officials releasing some new numbers about the damage from the Boyles Fire. That's the one in Lake County. So far, 81 acres have destroyed 55 buildings and 80 vehicles. Containment remains at 50%. Firefighters are now monitoring for hot spots. This fire started Sunday in Clear Lake in a high-risk zone. Nearby in Kelseyville, fire crews were able to control the Harbor Fire. It sparked on a Lake County hillside about 4.30 yesterday. It grew to about four acres. Evacuation orders have been lifted. No buildings were damaged. In Southern California, three fires are burning across the region. The largest is the Bridge Fire. It exploded in size overnight. It's now nearly 48,000 acres. It spans from Los Angeles all the way into San Bernardino County. The blaze is threatening communities, forcing evacuations and burning structures. Last night, flames reached the popular Mountain High Ski Resort. It has burned some cheer lifts. There is currently no containment. And in San Bernardino County, a 34-year-old man was arrested on suspicion of starting the line fire. This wildfire charred nearly 35,000 acres. It is 14% contained now. And the USDA is announcing some new funding to combat future fire risks. Our Washington correspondent Maddie Beertebel reports on this announcement and has reaction from California lawmakers. As thousands of acres in Southern California burn, we're announcing a commitment of $100 million. The USDA is investing in new projects to reduce wildfire risk across the country. That will fund 21 projects in 18 national forests. Agriculture Secretary Tom Vilsack announced the projects Tuesday. They span 14 states with a focus on prescribed burns meant to reduce the fuels that make fires worse. California is getting the largest chunk of that money, 15 million in total, for the El Dorado, Tahoe, and Sequoia National Forests. We never lost the Sequoia to fire for 1,200 years until 2017. And since then, we've lost 20% of the Sequoias. California Congressman Scott Peters is trying to prevent forest fires with his own legislation. His bipartisan Fix Our Forests Act is set for a House vote later this month. He also has a bill to save sequoia trees. And help can't come soon enough. We have a tremendous challenge with wildfires. The USDA money comes from the Inflation Reduction Act and bipartisan infrastructure bill. But Secretary Vilsack says more will be needed. And frankly, we need our friends in Congress uh, to continue to provide the resources. California Congressman Rose Kana wants to do that. The wildfire issue isn't going away, especially with climate change as temperatures get hotter and the air is drier. Kana says people can feel the impacts even far from the flames. It's really uh, devastating and there are times in Silicon Valley where we've gotten up and walked out and it's covered with uh, smoke. 